hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in MVC how to bind the data from a database into a drop-down list using repository pattern and here we got the final output I'm selecting the drop-down list notice the India US and Australia is binded using repository pattern in MVC let's check in my database table also See here the country table contains two columns CID and C name India, US and Australia. If you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial I am creating a new MVC application. Go to file new project. I am selecting ASP.NET web application and the .NET framework I am using 4.6.1. The application name is MVC drop down list repository pattern. Click OK. And from the templates, I'm selecting MVC4. Click OK. And here the project is successfully created. Let me close this default window. Open Solution Explorer. Now in this project I am adding ADO.NET Entity Data Model in this models folder. I click that one. Add ADO.NET Entity Data Model. I am selecting that one. The model name is Country Model. Click OK. And from the model contents I am selecting the EF Designer from database. The first one. Click Next new connection I'm adding my SQL server name after adding the server name I'm selecting the database name sample DB test connection it succeeded ok ok and here is the connection string which I want to save in the web.config file and the connection string entity name is a sample db entities click next and from the database objects I'm expanding the tables as well as dbo the table I'm selecting the country click finish and here is the entity data model of the countries added let's open solution explorer I'm minimizing the references folder notice the entity model is added in the models folder and as well as the country.cs file open that one in this country class notice there is two properties cid and c name so i'm not creating another class to creating the properties of the country class let's create a new folder right click the project name add new folder the folder name is the repository enter now in this repository folder I am adding one is an interface and the second one is a class right click the repository folder add interface the interface name I am adding country i interface i country and here we got the interface the first thing I'm adding the models folder using my project name is MVC DDL repository pattern dot models folder after adding the models folder now in this now in this interface I'm creating a method with the I enumerable I enumerable the country the method name is a get country after that let's add the new class in this repository folder right click that one add class the class name is a repository country add and here we got the repository country class also I'm adding the 
adding the namespace using MVC DDL repository pattern dot models folder after adding this namespace now in this class I'm implementing I'm adding the interface I country which is my interface name this one notice when I add this I country interface I got a small error to fix this implement interface and see here the get country is a method from the interface class is automatically added into this automatically added into this repository country class now the next step is we need to create a controller open solution explorer I'm adding the controller in this controllers folder right click the controller add controller I'm selecting the MVC for controller empty click add the controller name is the country add and here we got the controller also now I'm adding the namespaces using a project name is the MVC DDL repository pattern I'm adding the models folder as well as using MVC DDL repository dot repository this folder which contains the I interface and repository country now after adding these two namespaces now I'm implementing the interface private I country is the interface I'm creating an object I C O U and the next one I am creating a constructor for this country controller public country controller this dot SEOU is equals to new I am adding the repository country class repository country new I am adding my database connection string entity name which is a sample db entities and notice here we got the small error here to fix this generate constructor in repository country click that one see the error has gone and in the repository country class see the constructor is added now in the i enumerable I'm adding the implementation part return sample db entities dot countries the fire table name dot to list method after adding this sample db countries dot to list method in this i enumerable generic class in the get country method switch to the controller now in the index view page I'm declaring a variable country list is equals to I see you dot get country so method name dot to list I want to pass the variables from this controller to the index view page for that I'm using view bag dot country names is equals to so I want to bind this view bag in the drop down list so here new select list country list this one comma the second parameter is the object the objects here are column name CID and C name I'm adding both CID comma C name and the written view I'm adding this country list that's it we have done the coding part in the controller also 
but the last part is we need to add the view page of this action result index but before creating the index view page we must compile we must build this application build build solution and here we got the message the build succeeded let me close this output message box highlight this action result index right click that one add view the view name is the index only and the template from this list I'm selecting the list the last one the model class which is a country the data context class is a sample DB entities my connection string and make sure in the options the reference script libraries and user layout page both are checked then click add and here we got the index view page also with the default list template so uh, what I'm doing I'm deleting this default code which I don't require the create link and as well as for each loop let me delete this header tag also h1 how to bind data from database into drop down list in MVC using repository pattern horizontal line this in the center tag Now notice here in this table I have the display name file. I don't require this one because I want to bind the data into a drop down list. So I am adding here at html dot drop down list. The first parameter is the string name between double quotes. I am adding the table name which is the uh, countries. Copy this one. And the second parameter is the string option label. Switch to the controller. Let's copy this one viewback.country names. I'm getting data from this viewback.country names into this index page. Let's add this one as select list, comma. Third parameter is the object HTML attributes. So here I'm adding select country comma new style is equals to between double quotes width colon 180 pixels that's it we have done the complete coding part now before run this application the most important is we need to change the controller name in the road config file open solution explorer go to top app underscore start folder expand that one road config dot cs open that one notice in the controller the home controller name which is the default one i'm deleting that one and our controller name is a country i'm adding controller name country and the action view page is the index only which is this one that's it let's check the output google chrome and here we got the final output I'm selecting the drop down list notice the India US and Australia is binded using repository pattern in MVC let's check in my database table also see here the country table contains two columns CID and CNAME India US and Australia that's it